Okay, what we're looking at here is basically three tables and how we can use tables to neatly lay out a website. So we have your main table, which is your main part of your website. And you can't really see it, but right here is another table within that table, which consists of these two cells, one here and one here. Now within this cell, it has its own pink table here. And you notice how this picture is neatly centered and all this text is neatly left aligned. That's because it's got its own cell here and its own cell here. So to graphically illustrate that better, what I did was take this code, copy this code of this page into Composer. Same thing. This red outline is your main cell with a header. Um, you, you don't see the header and the images because I didn't uh, download the image files and as you can see right here there's another red outline main outline which is the second table within the main table and it has this yellow cell yellow background cell and this white background cell and within this cell is another table the whole pink table with its own two cells here and here. Okay, uh, To illustrate it better, and if you really want to understand HTML codes, here you have your main table and the table within a table which has its cells. TD is um, the code for cell. Here's one cell and here's a second cell. Now within this one cell is its own table which is a pink section and like I said this within the pink section it's separated into its own two cells right here and right here. So this picture is um, center aligned and this text is left aligned. So the basic question is how do we do this? So I'm going to open a new tab and I'll insert a single cell table. expand that out a little bit and I'd like to put an image at the top so we're going to cell properties and content alignment vertical alignment would be at the top centered apply and when I click up here it's on the top I'll insert an image just for demonstration purposes Oh, let's pick this light bulb. <clears throat> this is going to end up to be a light bulb moment. Okay. Now we have one cell, and if you want to create another cell on the side of this, you can just right click, insert, oh, table insert, and a cell after. Now a question was raised, why isn't there another box like this on the second cell that we created to, to be able to pull it, pull it out? 
Well, sometimes it shows and sometimes it doesn't. In this case, it doesn't, so you can have you can have to go up here and look for the vertical or horizontal arrows. Um, this one is for the left cell. And if we move a little bit to the right, there's the other one. Left click on your mouse and drag it out. And now we can see the, the little box or, or handle where we can drag this out further. Okay, this is another question that was that came up. Why did the left cell expand? Well, sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. But you can go back up here and left click and just drag it back. This one was set to 200 pixels. There we go. And in this box, if you want to add a table within this cell, you just find a location like right here, right click and insert a table. And if you want to make it a two cell table like we had, here we go. Okay. Now if you're interested in learning more about um, functions like this to create a simple one page website, you can download a free ebook from online-success101.com or click on the URL within the description box below this YouTube video. Thank you.